Hello everyone, Face of here. Welcome to the stream. This is the first ever uh, music stream I'm going to attempt. First off, I will preface this by saying I haven't changed anything on the stream. I haven't changed any of the filters. The music is actually, or the sound is actually coming through my stereo right now, or my speakers, so I don't have the headset. So I'm hoping it's going to sound okay. Um, I didn't change any of the filters, so I don't, I don't even know if that sounds like anything. Um, Hopefully it sounds okay. I don't know if the mic will actually pick up everything. Um, as you can tell, <laughs> I don't have any room. Like, this thing is huge. Like, I knew it was big. And then, uh, I, as the intro screen was going on, I was like, okay, I'm going to bring it down and try to get set up. I don't know if I should, like, move the mic over here. Because I don't know if I'm going to actually hit it. I don't know if I should move my keyboard somewhere. Because I need my stream deck. Also, I need to move the camera here, so maybe I'll do that. Andre Atlas, what's going on? Welcome back to the stream, my friend. Thank you for dropping in. Um, as you can tell, uh, I'm kind of out of sorts here. Uh, I'm going to try to modify this camera as best I can and see if it's going to help at all. The direction I want to go. It's like a little wonky, but I don't want to move it too much because this is obviously the doggo cam generally. And uh, since I'm not going to actually be doing this as much, I kind of don't want to wreck my normal stream setup. You know what I mean? And like right there, I just punched the mic. Um, maybe rotate it a little more. I don't know. And like sitting on a couch and playing this, I don't think it's actually going to work out very well. Which is another problem. Eh, that's good enough, I guess. Um, I mean, you, you can generally see it. And... Hopefully that sounds okay. I don't know. Maybe I should put a stream delay on and uh, check it myself. But essentially, what the idea here is, um, I got this instrument many, many years ago. Um, after seeing a video online of a... Oh, I can't remember her name. Oh, I feel awful. I'll post it in the link and stuff uh, when this goes on YouTube and stuff. But uh, it's beautiful. It, it sounds amazing. You know what? Maybe I'll bring it up. Maybe I'll find it. And show you guys where the inspiration came from. Maybe I'll make it a command or something if I want to do this more. Um, but it sounds absolutely beautiful. And I bought it. And then um, I haven't really played it ever. And uh, it was expensive. So I need to learn it. And after I go went to TwitchCon, I met some amazing musicians. And they have an amazing community. And while I was there, I was like, man, maybe I should get into the, the music side of things. And you know what? It would be an opportunity to finally learn this instrument. And uh, I kept putting it off, kept putting it off, telling myself I would set up some stuff. And then the government shutdown happened, which put me out of a job for a month. And that would have been the absolute perfect opportunity to have pursued this. But I psyched myself up. I got scared. I got nervous. Like I'm one of those type is I've always been able to pick something up and run with it and learn it very quickly. But this thing has like no resources online on how to learn. Um, the only thing I have to go by is this little sheet right here. This is the music scale for this bass drum. And I don't know how to read music. Um, I can hold a beat and, you know, learn, learn stuff by ear. A little bit. Um, when I did try to play this a couple years ago, I did teach myself um, Song of Storms from Zelda. Um, I just learned my or taught myself how to play it by ear, and it sounded really good. But it was years ago, and I did it for two hours in one day, and I got it down. And I was like, "Cool, I learned myself a song." Um, but I will not be able to learn or do that again now. Not after two years. So all I have to go on is the sheet on the scales and my ear. And hopefully this isn't boring to watch, which I would assume it would be. Um, anyway, so looking at this page. Ow, stepping on me, dog. 
Um, looks like we have half of the space drum. Looks like there's different notes. So, cutting down from here and towards me, uh, they call them natural notes. And then away from me is sharpened and flatted notes. So, let's try. And also, I need to know where to hit. So that's A4. And then this will be a flat note. Or a sharpened flat note. I don't know if that sounds okay. And let's try this one. See, in my left hand, my left hand doesn't work so well in general, so. That hurts! <laughs> I might have to get some, like, uh, gloves or something, like, hitting it right on the knuckle. I don't know, maybe that's not what you're supposed to do. Maybe you're supposed to use fingers. Uh, see, that's even harder to do, though, because the mic is so far away. and I feel like I, I'm not hitting it hard enough. I have no idea. But there's also something on this page that says, oh, there's another scale. Okay, so the whole space drum apparently is a chromatic space drum scale, but this half with the natural notes, there's a diatonic scale. I have no idea what any of this means. So if any of you are musicians, feel free to fill me in because I don't know what any of that means. The numbers 1 to 13 indicate the chromatic scale from the lowest note to the highest. So the chromatic scale would be... This doesn't actually look right. Because there's supposed to be a... a thing in front of me. And that doesn't look like it's in front of me. I figured that the the logo here would be front. Oh, wait. No. That looks like it's what it should be. So I got four notes on the top. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so this is the 13 note. C4? Alright, let's see if this actually will sound right. Going up scales would be... Maybe I should turn the mic on... Uh... Omni. Actually, I don't even know what Omni is. So, it'd be... That sounded right, so... Nope, I did that backwards. It's middle, right, left. Nope. All right, that sounds cool. I can't get... That one sounds different. I just need to learn how to hit that one right, I guess. There it goes. Oop. That sounds actually really pretty. All right, so that is the the diatonic scale. My thumb hurts already. So that's the diatonic scale. But the at the normal scale. Whoa. Whoa. It crosses the entire space drum. So it would be, it still starts in the same spot, but then goes up here, down here. Oh, maybe it goes, ha so it goes bop, 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 bop. Where's five? Five. Oh no, I had that wrong. One, two, 
three. Oh yeah, see, it looks like it actually crosses three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, crap! I'm getting, because like, if you look at the page, if it'll focus, see there's different colors. There's orange and blue. And the blue is the diatonic scale, which is the first half. What's up, man? Out. I'm trying to learn something. Cool. Yeah. So I'll give it a shot. Yeah. But we'll see. Yeah. It's it's I have to sit here like with my legs down. Because if I cross them, it wants to fall off. Yeah. So it, this is not comfortable. Yeah, it's because right now it's not in the position. No, it's be. not a comfortable position, but so I'm gonna try to learn something. How's yeah. how's family? They're good, man. Grandpa's Grandpa's good. all right? Yep, he's already walking without a cane. Dude, surgery stuff weeks, is amazing. He's already up and going. So. When I had my surgery, they had me up and walking on it the same day. Oh yeah, they said it's he, amazing. He's healing like a thirty-year-old man. That's crazy. dude. Your your grandpa's a champ. Yeah, he just when he gets it in his head, he's like, no, nope, I'm getting better. Yeah, it's like I don't want to be stuck here. <laughs> he's a champ. He is. Oh, I should be careful drinking that. It's gonna drop on it. You got this thing is apparently, it's of course it's made of metal, so it's prone to rusting and stuff. And apparently you're supposed to clean it with some sort of oils and stuff. So I may have to learn all that. But anyway, so what I was saying is I was getting confused. It, you, you, your brain just sees numbers on a page and it's like, okay, cool. Follow them in order. And I made it about halfway and then I switched to the orange scale. Or I started switching to the blue. So it goes one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. This is seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Man, that one's way more difficult. My my eyes naturally fixate on the blue because they're outside of the little rings. So let's let's see if we can just remember it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah, oh, I messed it up already. I might have to like reprint this and like scribble out the blues because it throws me off. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, so yeah, it it's the idea is it tries to cross the space drum with the notes. That's far more difficult than my brain is allowing me to think. So, bump, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. I made it to seven. I'm impressed. Oh, seven is seven, eight, nine. Nope. That sounds lower. Eight. There it is. This is nine. So, one, two, three, four, five. Shit. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Woo! All right. Nope. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Done. All right. Ow! I hit a little too hard. Okay, cool. So, I think. I have no idea how to learn an instrument either, so this is all just firing from the hip here. Um, I'm wondering if I should just learn the scales and get comfortable with knowing... I don't know what it's called, a range? The scale range? Um, so get comfortable. So that would also help me when I'm learning to play a song by ear, would I be like, okay... I'd be like, alright, is it this beat? Or is this this sound, this tone? Nope, needs to be lower or something. Then I'd be like, all right, you know, 
or whatever. I could maybe do something like that. Uh, that may be something I want to learn, but what I think I should start with doing is getting comfortable with how the scale plays. Um, getting, uh, I don't want to say speedy because that sounds sloppy, but getting to the point where I can comfortably climb the scale and then start learning how to do it backwards. Um, and according to the sheet, we have two scales to learn. We have the, the chromatic and the diatonic scales, so I might want to learn those. I have no idea what either of those mean, um, so I'm going to have to look that up at some point, um, make a note for myself in my brain. Um, but so, and maybe I need to learn, this might be in the future, but like if, if you're noticing when I'm playing, I'm just, if it's on the right side, I'm doing my right hand, which feels like it should be smart, but I also should learn to like go up the scales backwards, you know? So, you know what I mean? So like go up the scale with right, left, and then I could go left, right, hitting the same beats. Notes, tones. I don't even know what to call them. I am not a musician, obviously. Um, all growing up, though, when I was in music classes and stuff, my teachers tried to encourage me because I learned things quickly and I was able to... I don't even know how to say it. Like, when we were forced to play recorder, uh, I did trumpet or hold beats and stuff for, like, a drum... I was really good at doing that, and the teachers would try to always encourage me to get into music, but, you know, we couldn't afford it as a family, so I never did it. So I never actually spent the time to try to learn actually how to read music and stuff. I can remember some of the, the names, like a TT, I think is what it was called. That's about it. Uh, but, like, when in terms of, like, G-sharp, I have no idea what that means. Or even if it exists, like they're actually are on the sheet. Yeah, there is a G sharp. Ha ha! Sharp is the the number symbol or hashtag, right? I believe that's right. But so there's like a G sharp four. No idea what that means. Or an E B four C five A four G four. No, no idea what any of that means. So. It sounds cool, though. Hopefully it sounds okay coming through to the stream. Like, also... I'm, I'm assuming you can hit other parts of the drum, too, for just, like, an effect. Like, I think you can technically hit the bottom of the drum, but I'm not going to be able to do that, especially with this setup. But I think what I will do here is get the diatonic scale in my brain? Or would that not be wise? I don't know which one I should start with. Maybe I should look up what the difference is between them to find out what would be the smarter one to start with. Because I'm not sure. But actually the diatonic is definitely the easiest. It's Oops, no. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, four. Yeah, that's right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That one I can't hit right. It doesn't sound right to me. Oops. Okay, so now should I switch it? So go backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So. Nope. Yeah, that sounded right. So, ba 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 ba.
Wow. Like, my muscle memory was already trying to go up the scale, now it's like bro breaking already. Dang it. Ding, 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 ding. There it is. Dang it. Alright, I need to actually focus on not trying to just do it quickly. I need to focus on brain, get it into your... Because I'm going like... You know how you, when you're in school and you got to study for a test or something, you just kind of speed read it and just try to cram as much information in your brain later just so you can regurgitate it later? That's not really learning. So what I, want, I need to make myself do is not learn in that way. I need to learn to retain. So I need to go like do deliberate... Like deliberate hits, right? Because that, that'll help me retain it better, I would assume. There, see? Much better. Much better. Oh, it's six, seven, eight. That's it. things my finger hurts so bad i don't know if i should um i'm gonna <laughs> i'm gonna pull a go borgo and put something on my hand i don't think i have any sort of gloves what if i um i'm wondering if i should like tape some gauze or something across my thumb or i need to learn to play with my fingers but that's hard to do when i can't move my arms back here that's Probably just because I'm on the the couch here. I'm gonna do this. Move this. See if I can get a little bit of... But see, like, when I hit the side of my thumb, it it's a crisp, clear, resonant tone. But when I... If I don't quite hit it right with my finger, it stops the resonance. And it's qu much quieter. Maybe it's because I have a small finger. Yeah, see, it doesn't sound quite right. Maybe I need to hit with the tip of my thumb. That feels a little better. Yeah, so if I hit with the tip of my thumb instead of my the ball of my, I don't know, my knuckle, that feels a little better. It doesn't hurt. Hey, hey, stop. Hey, stop. Mama. All right, dogs are wrestling. Hey. Stop it. Nope. Knock it off. No. I know you're trying to wrestle, but you're going to make me freak out and drop this thing or something. Mama, don't you dare. I'm watching you. I'm watching you. All right, so that's the diatonic scale. So what if I... So what if I learned to skip? So it would be do 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 So it would be one, two, three. So So they're all on the right, that makes sense. So it's one, three, five, seven, and two, four, six, eight.
that's how we'll learn to play the different notes by switching because I'm staying left and right here. Right? But if I do one three five seven, it'd be one three five it'd be one three five seven. Oops. That sounds cool. And then if we do two, four, six, eight, it'd be. Uh, that doesn't sound right. That's cool. Thumbs hurt. Oops. That doesn't feel... Yeah, that's how it should be. That is much better, because what I was doing, I was doing five, six, seven, eight. I should be switching it to be six, seven, eight by switching my hands. That feels much better. See? It's eight, seven, six. It should be eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so I got I gotta retrain. Oops. That's much better. this note quite right in that in that scale hold on there we go that's much better and then we do one three five seven right and then two four six eight Which order should I do that? Yeah, that's how I should do it. Wait, is that right? Two, four, yeah. So it'd be boop, 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 boop. That's why it's wrong. Can you tell I'm right-handed? And then if we do eight, six, five, eight, six, four, two. That's hard to hit with the the couch rest here. Maybe it would be smart <laughs> if I do this more. Maybe I'll like set up in the middle of the couch or something so I have more room. All right. Try this one. That doesn't sound right. One, three, five, seven. Oh yeah, that's why I was went wrong. Nope. Crap. One, three, five, seven. One, three, five, seven. Why does it work on this side? Two, four, six, two, four, six, eight. One. It goes, oh, that's why, because the six is here. So I have to do. The scale is different on this side. Or the scale is not different, but the progression is different. Oh, you know what? 
I forgot to do a notification on Discord. Oh well. Let's do. So we just we're learning the diatonic scale, right? So what if I learn? It doesn't feel natural to go backwards. Because then, um, see, if I were to go up the scale by switching them from where normally I would hit right, left here, and going left, right, I have to cross my hands. That doesn't necessarily feel right. And I don't know if there's ever a reason to do that. The most efficient way is that. The only time I would cross is when I'm going to be going up this scale, right? But I don't know if there's actually a time where I need to be doing this. Why Why would I do that when I can do this? I don't know if you guys can actually see over there. I'm, what I'm trying to say is like, why would I do something like this? Or why would I do this when this feels far more efficient? I don't know if there's an instance where I need to be like playing something like this and then when I need to slide or something. But even then, like, that feels way more efficient. So I don't, I don't think actually crossing the hands is what I should be doing. Also, let me get some coffee. Uh, and maybe we'll look up um the Song of Storms and try to teach us that again. But, oops. I naturally want to move right there. That's where I need to stop. I need to do. I need to break that habit that I've already got. It's much better. I missed that note completely. Woo! I'm getting hot. I don't know if it's because of them. Actually, it's probably a combination between the movement and the coffee. That coffee from that coffee shop makes me sweat. I don't know why. I, I never get coffee sweats. I've never gotten coffee sweats from anywhere. But this coffee place makes me sweat like crazy. Okay, so I don't know. Oh, you know what? Where's my phone? Let's um. I do need to. I put a a notice in Discord real quick. So please forgive <gasps> the tardiness here. Uh. Tsh -tsh -tsh -tsh. Um, I think there's a Denver music. General Twitch specific. Um. I don't even know where to put this. Maybe I'll maybe it's in general. I'll post it here. Uh, I don't know if it goes in general. Twitch specific. No. I, is this considered a percussionist? I think this is a percussion instrument, right? All right, so. All right, I'm going to try to post. Here, I guess.
Please hold. I should just do this. I don't want to bring the keyboard and put this thing on the floor, so please hold. Got to do it through the phone. Boop, boop, sorry. One de downside of this um, is <laughs> there's no doggo cam, which is kind of a bummer. Oops. Typo, gotta fix that. All right, I think we are good enough, right? All right, good enough. Let's let's get out of here. I want to I want to get back to this. Try and teach myself. Maybe I should open up the Song of Storms song or show uh, the inspiration uh, clip. Let's do that real quick. Now I'm actually going to switch to the keyboard. I could have just done that whole thing, that whole post in Discord immediately here. Um. I'm gonna make a command real quick, so people that drop in can uh, be like, why you want to play this or whatever, you know what I mean? OBS Overwatch, that's what I want. Music. Music. Okay, so new command. In inspiration. Okay. Uh, maybe I'll just, uh, I don't know. Enabled group. Everyone can do it. Inspiration. All right. Bam. Uh, here we go. Copy this. Ooh. Nope, that's not what I meant to do.
All right, let's see if it works. All right, that works. Good enough for me. And I don't have a song list and stuff yet, but whatever. Good enough. Cool. Now there's a command. So people can learn that. Ooh, got it, got it, got it. Okay. Oh, I can't sit like this. <laughs> it wants to fall over. Ugh, gotta sit, gotta sit. Hi, Doggo. What are you doing? Sorry, you can't sit there. Doggy's gotta lay on the, the ground. I apologize. Also, I don't know if... That sounds really pretty. That's too deep. There it is. I think that's the note I want. Dang it. can't find the note I want. That's slightly too high. So that's five, six. That's six on the diatonic scale though. So that might not be right. I want ding, ding, you know what I mean? That might be it, but it doesn't sound quite right when I'm playing it. too high. That's that is the note. I just have to hit it right. Maybe it's a I have to hit the note right, or it doesn't sound right. That's it. Why am I going fast? I'm learning, I'm teaching myself a song. <sighs> that note is difficult for me to hit for some reason. I don't know where to go beyond that. I was just kind of playing around and sound <laughs> it sounded pretty, so I just went with it. Maybe I should go back to teaching myself the scales instead of jumping too far ahead here. All right, so maybe we'll learn the chromatic. So it's one, two. It crosses, right? So one, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, nope, seven. Seven is up here. The picture is misleading. The picture makes it look like seven is here, but this is two. So. Oops, one, two, three. Is that three? That is three. I messed up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six is here. That's why. Six, seven, eight, nine. That's weird. I figured it would have done like a star pattern, but that's not what it does. It goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <sighs> the seven is in front, not here. The picture is throwing me off. Oops, I did do that wrong. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Now I need to try to do it without looking at the paper. And making sure because like when I'm looking at the paper and going back and forth, I'm just kind of hitting, but I want to make sure that I'm actually hitting the correct scales or notes. So it'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Ha! Did it. All right. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. All right. My thumbs are killing me. Um, okay, so once I feel comfortable with this one, we'll go down the scale and try to figure that out. So it'd be one, two. Also, I should be crossing with my hands instead of relying on my right hand here. Cause like if I'm play if I'm going to end up playing like a fast song, this could not be an efficient move, right? So it has to be like one, two, three, four. I just did it. I pulled back. I just did the opposite. Oh. So this is getting into that circumstance where I was talking about crossing my hands, because if I play it that way, it's going to be one, two, and then three would be over here. And that's crossing, and I don't think I want to do that. So going up the scale, I might want to do one, two, three, four. I think I'm going to end up crossing that way, too. So it would be one, two, three, four. Yep, there's a cross there. Hmm. I don't know the most efficient way to play this. Maybe I should just do it what feels natural. And then uh, I'll come up with better movements as I need. I'm not sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine. That six, seven is weird to me because my brain goes five, six. Oh, that's not five, six. That's eight. Like six feels like seven should be over here, but it's not. It's six, seven, eight. That's what it is. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. All right. Let's All right, so now I got a picture. We'll do this going up the scale, and I'm going to try to remember going back down because my brain doesn't remember 10, 11, 12, 13, or whatever. Like, looking at this right now, it's my mind's blank. I don't know. My fingers are doing the movement here. So we'll go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So it goes 10, 11, 12, 13. So it would be 13, 12, 11, 10, Where's not nine, eight, seven, six, five, six, five, four, three, two, one. That's right. That was janky though, so. 13, 12, 11, 10, nine. Is that nine? It is, I was right. 13, 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, 
four, three, two, one. Aha! All right, we're learning, we're learning. I have to actually count in my brain, otherwise I lose track of where they're gonna be, which is probably a bad sign. Whoops. How did I do that wrong? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, I already messed that up. Ten is in front of me. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I was doing that. It goes like that. Okay. I was <laughs> I was going ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen or the ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I was doing thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten. I was going backwards when I was going up the scale. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine. Is that nine? That is nine. I keep at jinxing myself out. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, five. That's five. I messed that up. I keep, I keep psyching myself out that that's not nine, and it totally is. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. What? Why does it sound deeper? Because that's four. This is nine. Was I psyching myself out properly? Man, that, that scale is way harder. All right, let's um, let's look up Song of Storms real quick. See if I can learn to play it. Let's see if we can uh, actually get some motivation because I'm the type of person that I need a goal to pursue and just learning the scales. I know that's a goal, but my brain doesn't work that way. Oh, hey, cool. Focus is going out because I'm leaning over. All right, let's learn a song of storms. Let's update the title. And learn. Eh. We'll keep that first music stream. Let's learn Song of Storms. Because everyone loves Song of Storms. I love it. It's beautiful. And everyone loves Zelda. And if you don't, you lie! Alright, so it's... Right, let's find the right note. Actually, you know what might be smart? We might be able to just... Ugh. Holy crap. Thing is heavy. Cicellus, what's up, my dude? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, yeah, I finally busted it out. How you doing, my man? It's been a while. You're gonna have to let me know if everything sounds okay because I changed nothing with the filters. I'm too scared. I'm, I'm too scared to change my filters for my normal standard setup. Um. Uh, I don't even know how to look this up. Music, song of sheet music, maybe? Notes. I don't know. I don't even know how to look this up. You're a music artist, though, so uh, maybe you can give me some tips, tricks, and 
Good stuff. Because I don't know how. What notes make up the Song of Storms? Uh, the tune is in D minor from lowest to highest. The notes and melody are D, E, G. I don't know if that actually works for me. Does this tell me what kind of notes? I don't even know how to look that up. Hey, Hippo. And it depends on what instrument you like to play the song, but I just do the piano. I found this hopeful. Stinks. Yeah, I don't even think I could actually look this up unless I found something that met the scale that uh, the space drum uses. DFD? Yeah, I'm glad you know it. Yeah, I, at least for now, it looks like I'll be going back in tomorrow. I need to see if I actually got an official start work order, which would be great. This whole time, I should have been teaching myself the, the space drum, but I kind of procrastinated due to the fears. But you said DFD? I have no idea what my scale is, man. I don't even know how to, how to know that. I can tell you I have a chromatic scale and a diatonic scale. So if you know what those are, feel free to fill me in, because I don't know what those are either. Um, but you said DFD. Let's see if I have a DFD on this thing. Or a D and an F. I have a D4. I have a D4 and an F4. That sounds about right. Oh god, this thing is so heavy. And I can't sit that's comfortable because it'll fall off. So chromatic is the full scale of 12 notes. No. Oh, yes, you're right. Uh, chromatic, it's a 13 note, actually, that I have. But it's... um. Half the space drum, about right here, is the diatonic scale. But um, the, the entire space drum is a 13-note chromatic. But you said D, F, D, huh? So that would be... Wait, isn't Song of Storms, it goes do do D, so that's a higher note. So it wouldn't be D, F, D, right? Because D is low. So chromatic is a full scale of 12 notes. Diatonic means within a key. So depending on its range, you can do any scale. Really? Unique notes. I got you. Okay. All right. Yeah. Feel me in. Send me all this knowledge. Because uh, I don't know how to... <laughs> I'm not very... I shouldn't say musically inclined because I, I... I don't even know how the phrase of... Or how to phrase it. But musicality, I think I'm pretty good with. But actually playing music and the terms and what it all means. Like this stuff. That. If it'll focus. Yeah. That is in my brain. It means nothing to me. So, if you can feel me that in, I would love that. So it would be... That sounds alright. Does it sound alright? That sounds alright! And then it's got to be a really high note. So 8. This is 8, so maybe... Ooh, that's deep. There you go, that's seven, that's seven. 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 Eight. Nine. Maybe nine? Oh, no, that's not eight. This is thirteen. This is the, this is the highest note I have. <laughs> Maybe I'll do that way. That sounds better. So it's the low D, two steps higher of it to an F and up to the next higher D. I don't think I have multiple Ds. I have one D. Yeah, I have D4, that's it. So my thought would be, maybe I should make a command uh, for the scales so like any music people like you yourself could drop in and get a link to this page. Know what I mean? 
so you could actually see the scales that I'm working with. So it sounds like if I don't have multiple of those notes, I'm not to fake it. So this sounds okay. Does that sound okay to you? I don't know how it sounds actually coming through the mic. And this is seven, or this is 12. That means there's not much higher than that, which is a problem. Maybe I'll do. That's not high enough. I gotta move this, I'm gonna punch it. That's not high enough. That's not high enough. Could be helpful or you can change the key. How can I change the key? Oh, oh, yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to fake it. Like right now, you want, here, you know what? Let, let's go find that. Let's actually see if I can even find the scale and make a command for you. Hey, Pato, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Fortunately, Song of Storms does range more than an octave. Yeah, I'm noticing. I'm, I think I might have to just fake it. Let's see if I have a... Uh... Oof. I don't even know where I'd find it. Scale. Space drum. Uh, oh, hey. No way. Is this from where I got my note? Or my... Space drum? That'd be kind of sweet. Uh... Oh. Maybe I'll just steal this. This is the 13 note. Um, hey, I'll do this. I don't have the, I didn't find the paper that I'm using. But I did find the skit. Oh, wait, this might be better. I might be able to use this. Let's see. Is this the same? C4. That's D4, D4, D4. Hey, this is, I'm going to use this, this image, this image works. All right, I'm going to, I'm going to make a command real quick. Please hold commands. All right, save. Another command, uh, scale. That sounds right. The Thirteen note. Scale is... Also, you have to let me know if these, uh, the terminology makes sense at all. Or, uh, the way I'm writing these, and I'm... Dude, I don't even know what I'm talking about. Oops, did I accidentally close that page? Did I close that page? Where did it go? Where's my browser windows? Oh, I pulled it somewhere else. Here we go. Visit this page. I want the image, bro. It's not letting me steal that image. Copy. Can I just copy the image address? Is it going to be crazy? Nope. Cool. This will work. This will. This is acceptable, I think. We'll work with this. Okay, so let's try this scale. I don't like that it posts on two lines. There we go. That's good enough. I think I don't want to waste too much time making you guys <laughs> watch me com create commands and stuff, so we'll deal with this. Let's see if it'll work. Scale. 
scale image. Okay, cool. It's one line. It's good. I can accept that. It's a long ass link, but it works. Oh no, dog took my spot. Okay, let me see what you're seeing, Cicillus. Faking is great. It's your interpretation after all. <laughs> Yeah, eventually, once I, if I keep playing this up and keep playing it, or keep this up and keep playing, that's the term, phrase I'm looking for, is I would go from just the normal, like, 8-bit sound of ding, 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 you know, I could actually learn or teach myself a, ver a variation or a cover, like, you know, pianists, you know, when they're playing a song, you first learn with, like, a plink and plink and plink and plink, and then they can get melodic and make it all sound fancy beautiful so that might come out another time um but let's see long crosses i wouldn't consider myself good yet by any stretch dude i love listening to music and i admire your uh your dedication to that, that that's that's huge to me interesting and it mixes sharps and flats yeah crazy huh um i was hoping to find this exact photo maybe i'll like I don't have a scanner or anything, but I'll find a way to actually get this whole thing so then people actually can see the different notes that um, and how, how it's divided between the chromatic and diatonic scale. I don't know. I don't know. That, that, that's more thinking than I think I care to, to do right now. Don't knock that over, turd. Um, okay. Well, crap. I already forgot <laughs> where I left off. On this thing. Okay. Now I gotta stretch out my legs again. It's so not comfortable sitting like this. I don't remember where I left off. Um, I think I was trying to use this scale. That actually sounded good. That's 10 though. That means I only have three more notes to work with. Is it higher? It goes do 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 do. Is that a higher note or a lower note? It sounds like a higher note. Oh, I think we've made progress already. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. So, dun, 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 dun. something like that. This might be able to be a little higher. You know what I mean? We're seven. Whoa, that's not seven. No, that's too high. So I think I think this sounds okay. Because I got to start really low, unfortunately. It's do 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 do. Then it do do. Then it's two drops. Would that be it? Might need to go slightly lower. Might need to go slightly lower. That doesn't sound quite right. Can you actually hear it, by the way? You'll have to let me know if you can actually hear it. I don't know if I, that sounds right. Ooh. Mm. What do I do? That sounds too low. That's too low. Mm. This note I have trouble hitting. It's a weird angle. That sounds a little better. That sounds way better. Ah. Uh. 
that cross though is killing me. You hear that? Does that sound sound better? That sounds way better than That's way better. Yeah, I like that. Oh, I think we just taught ourselves Song of Storms, dude. Oops. That note sucks. It's the, I think it's the, the armrest here on my couch. Nope. I need to actually slow down and get my finger movements to be like... I should move... Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to do that. So I want to do... Yeah, so... It feels really awkward not just going back and forth with the hitting of the notes. I actually have to do bop, 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 bop. Use the same hand. It feels a little weird, but it works. I need to hit that note. Hit that note better. Hey, we learned Song of Storms. If I can do it consistently. I, I did both. <laughs> both my hands on that one that time. My hand wants to instinctively hit that again. I can't I can't burn through it. My brain is trying to anticipate and my fingers are trying to hold the whole bop 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 which is like right left right left right left. My fingers are trying to hold that and my brain is trying to anticipate and it's not working. Oh no problem man. Welcome back. All right, I think I got like five in a row there. That was so. Okay. I'm trying to find a better angle for my left arm here. Oh, now I can't even do it. Okay, so anywhere on this ring, it sounds okay. But as soon as I get slightly out of, it sounds hollow. I'm getting better at hitting this note. This note was troublesome for me this whole time. Oh, I hit that and didn't pick up. I wonder, can you change the note? You can make it hollow. I don't know if you guys can hear that, so I'm bringing the mic over. See if you can hear this. 
So, but then if I cover, see it sounds, if I do it too much, then it doesn't sound good. But if I just cover like half of it, it kind of mutes it, but it still has the tone. Interesting. That might be something to experiment once I get better. Maybe that's throwing me off too, if I do. Nah, I'm right handed, I, I need to maintain that. Also, you know what? I forgot. Uh, let's see if I can do this. Eh. If you guys don't know Cicellus, he's a good friend of mine. He does uh, music and editing streams. Go give him a follow and check out. And uh, he's also been assisting me learning the musics here. So I appreciate you, man. Thank you so much for dropping in. Everyone go... Give Cicellus some loves. He recently uh, hit... How long has it been now, Cicellus, that uh, you hit affiliate? A few months now? So go throw him some bits and subscriptions. Mm. I keep wanting to pull the mic closer, but as it gets above the space drum, I literally have this much width. Like, these two fingers until I smack it so but I don't I don't know if um can you still hear hear this note reliably or does this one sound like crazy louder does it those sound like reasonably the same volume or just after chest con that's awesome yeah rock on man That's not sounding right anymore. Because I'm missing a note. I think I was skipping a note on accident. Sound isn't too bad. Yeah. Whoa. I spoke in such a, a way that it like vibrated through the space drum and it sounded all echoey in the space drum. That was wild. If I wanna if I were to keep up playing this, I'd have to I'd have to crazily rearrange my setup, which worries me, which was also the main reason I put this off for so long. I think I think I could get away with Maybe I could get another stand or something for the mic itself and make that less obtrusive so I could actually have the mic in front of me or like up here. And so that way I'd have clearance all around me. Um, and maybe you would get more of a fuller tone from stuff that's away from the mic like this. Um, that shouldn't be too difficult if I want to maintain this. However, the other problem is since I'm on the couch here, this armrest could become a problem. And if that's the case, then I'd want to slide over a little bit more. But then that means I completely derail the cam setup and stuff. And I hate having to redo all, everything. So that's another issue. I think I can live with the armrest. The mic might be something I could switch up. The other thing is I'd have to come up with some... Uh, because I'm going to have to watch all this afterwards to just to kind of hear it um, to see how it sounds. And then if that's the case, I'm going to have to come up with some different filters or something to... Because I want to maintain the, the background. I, I want that all cleared out. I don't want to hear you guys to hear the fans and stuff of the computer. You'll hear dogs snoring because they're loud. Sorry, that's, that's just going to happen. <laughs> but um, 
I don't want it to sound hollow, and I want it to actually sound like music. Um, I thought about doing... Um, I've been watching other streamers. Uh, you you actually are doing it too, Celis, I've noticed. Um, uh, you have the... Uh, it, sound, it sounds like a concert hall. So you, there's like an echo uh, to your voice. I, I don't even know what you would call that. Um, but a lot of a lot of the uh, music streamers do that, and it I think it ups the quality of the music streams a little bit. Um, so maybe I'll play around with that a little bit. Uh, in terms of gaming, though, I, I don't obviously want an echo. So I'll have to look into that. But I don't know. It's something, it's some idea, but I'm glad we learned a song. It, I'm actually seeing the mic pick that up, even though I'm barely tapping it. Reverb, that's the word. Thank you. I do it through an interface. I think I tried doing a, a reverb thing at once, one point. Actually, you know what? I may still have it saved. Um, but I'm not sure how it sounded here. If I still have it saved, let's see. Oh, and you can tell me how it sounds. I don't think I have really played with it much. I think the first time I played with reverb is when... Um, I used it for the stream boss, and so like when a stream boss came in, I would turn it on so it sounded all cool and stuff, but in order to get reverb on, the program had to have focus, and I don't want to switch focus from a game or something just to enable that for 20 seconds and then turn it off, you know what I mean? But if I'm doing a music stream like this, I would probably just want to keep it on, right? Let's see, do I have it on? It looks like I might. All right, it looks like I have two, actually. And I haven't done this for like four or five months, maybe. Or at least since TwitchCon. So I don't even know if these are actually set up right or if they're using the proper filter still, but I'm going to toggle them and you can tell me there's two of them, apparently. So I'm um, turning off my normal filter. All right, this is the second filter. I don't know if there's actually a reverb going on at all or anything, but this is the second one I have set up. I'm gonna turn this one off and then I'll turn on the third one. All right, this is the third reverb one. Uh, they may not actually have proper filters set up either for canceling background noise. I may be stupid loud and maybe stupid quiet compared to my normal filters. Um, but there's apparently two of them to play with, so I'm going to go back to the normal. There we go. Back to normal. But I don't know. If, was there a lot of reverb in one of those? That's quite a lot of reverb. <laughs> yeah, see, I don't even know. Maybe I should, I'll make a marker so I can uh, hear it. Really? That command doesn't work anymore? What? No wonder it didn't show up. I made when I was playing uh, the games with my friends yesterday. I tried to make a marker and it didn't work. Or I was like, oh, maybe I just didn't push it hard enough. Oh, hello. Shush. So maybe the command is broken. So I'll just I'll create a manual one. Hold on. Please hold. Uh, add. There we go. Good enough. Cool. I'll check that out after stream. I kind of want to hear what it sounds like. All three. <laughs> Turn them all on. Here, let's, let's experiment. Let's see what that sounds like. All right, all three filters are on. <laughs> I have no idea what it's doing. Like, I don't even know how it would work. Because they're all three being used, so I'm sure that sounds like trash. But, all right. Back to normal. Something fun. Was that crazy? <laughs> Holy crap, I'm so hot. It's so hot down here. Uh, okay. I'm gonna check something else out here. Is it, um, Cicelis, is there anything else you think I should, um, have for the music stream? Like, is there anything 
um, that is useful to have as a music streamer to provide to viewers or resources or any of that kind of stuff? Like, um, yeah, as you know, I, I don't do this for uh, normal stream stuff, but I would like to, if I want to continue doing this, I want people to be able to drop in and feel like they can do things, I guess. I don't know. Okay, that's good. All right, good enough. It's learning today. Hey, Hitch, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Thanks for dropping in. Um, I would do song requests if I knew what I was doing. Um, as Cicela says, this is actually my very first stream. Um, I'm learning the instrument. Um, by itself right now. Here, I'll give you a sh I'll give you a look see. Sorry, I was doing command stuff and figuring things out. Oh, now I gotta get comfortable again. Okay, so this is a space drum. Um, and mostly what's going on today is I'm learning the scales stuff. And uh, for funds, uh, Cicelis and I just learned how to play Song of Storms from Zelda. Uh, at some point, if I continue doing uh, the music stream, um, normally, I'm a variety gamer. Um, this is my first time doing this. Is um, In my Discord, I actually have a list of songs I would like to learn how to play on the space drum. Um, also, song requests would be open once I actually know how to play this instrument. Um, so that would be a thing. Uh, there, there's song requests as of, and hey, I think you should learn to play this song, as well as, hey, can you play this song and just play it on stream? Another idea I'd like to do is... Uh, like a, maybe a play along. I don't even know how you'd call it. Um, but someone could be like, yo, here's a YouTube video of a song. Just improv play with it. You know what I mean? I don't even know what you'd call that. Would that be improv? So Celeste, you might know better on how that works. But essentially, it's like someone could essentially uh, throw a YouTube link and just say, play along with this kind of thing. And I, I think that could be fun or interesting to do. And I have this massive shadow with my lights. Are my lights on too bright? What's going on with these? My lights were too bright. No wonder. Uh, getting cooked alive by these lights here. It depends on what you want. I would say I'm not experienced enough to give you advice on that side. Nah. Any experience, or any experience, any advice is good advice, I'd say, right? Streamer song list is a good tool for sure. Yeah, I did, um, I do have one of those. I found a site that I would use, but the thing is, I know one song right now. So, um, <laughs> the streamer song list would be, hey, what do you want to do? Bam! Zelda Song of Storms. That's all you can request. <laughs> yeah, the violin chick. Yeah, she's the one I've seen do that. Uh, it's it's improv? Okay, good to know. Good to know. Um, but, okay. The lights feel so much better right now. I'm, it's not glaring off the space drum. Actually, the space drum looks really pretty right now, too. Like, it looks all... It looks like a crazy bronze right now, but it's not really that bronze. It's more of a... slightly brownish steel. Alright. Mm-mm. I'm getting... Dog's gonna knock over my keyboard, I know it. Uh oh, hold on. Phone is going off. And I need to pay attention to this stuff here. Because I don't know if uh, I'm going to be getting messages from a boss saying, yo, time to come in. Well, can't go in. It's a weekend, but saying like, see you Monday. Mm -mm, didn't work. I had to break that habit. Or I could just do that, but it sounds like I need to break the habit because I think if I work around a habit, it's still encouraging bad behavior or 
not bad behavior, but bad habits. And you don't want to learn on bad habits, right? Because then they become a crutch. Dang it, missed that note. I didn't learn the whole song. There's a whole section after this, isn't there? I've learned half of the song. Cicellus, call me out on that. Because the... Holy crap, I, I've learned half of the song. <laughs> And then it'd be. Hmm. D D D D D. Sounds like it would still be this note. D D. It's not that note. It's a drop. It's a it's a it's a lower note from this. That's not right. Uh Is it a drop? It sounds like a drop. That sounds like it's the same note. It's like D, 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 D. It sounds like it's the same note. And then it drops D, D. Right? My brain is falling or failing on what is there. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's pretty. <laughs> 10 songs and I need to update it really badly. Dude, that's still impressive. Like, that's awesome. I think it's the one again. This one. Yeah, so it's but then it drops, right? Do six. Mm. It sounds like it goes too low, though. E, that's too low. I may not have that scale to be able to do that properly. Oh, <gasps> actually, that might work. Oh, hey. Hmm. That might work. I hit that way too hard. That sounds way more... I don't even know what the term is. Like, this one sounds like... It hits a note and it's like, boom, it's sharp. And then this one sounds deep and resonant. You're going to grab your melodica? <laughs> That's how I would learn, dude. It's like, I don't know the note, but I know how to do it on my instrument so I can figure out how to do it on my instrument, find out the note of that instrument, and then relay it to you. That's exactly what I do. Actually, maybe it does go up. You know what? Let's Google it. We can actually find a scale to see if it actually goes up or down, and then I can just figure out the note. Uh, I don't like laying that thing on its side. Okay. Also, the webcam 
It is doing all sorts of goofy stuff. I don't know why. Let me check it out real quick. It's like focus box isn't working right anymore. It used to. Like, oh, now it's working. It's moving. Okay, I got it. That's good enough. Now, um, notes here. Let's see if this will work. Uh, okay, so I found the sheet music. Oh. Yeah, so it does go down. It goes. Oh, and then it goes even lower. Yeah, this is for the ocarina. That's funny. Maybe that's not the one I should be looking at. I don't want the complicated one. La re fa so la. That's how it goes. A D F G A. Oh, hey, this one has thing. Let's see. A D F G A. This is no way. It's not my my scale isn't gonna work with the same, right? A D F G A. No way. No way. No way. I'm gonna try it though. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. <clears throat> Hi, doggo. Sorry, but you need to scoot your butts. There you go. So, oh, God. I hate that I have to put my legs down. A D F G A. Oh my god, that's totally right. What? That was super simple. Let's listen to this. Listen to this. This is right. Oops. Really? That's it? Oh. Uh you posted. Okay, so it's C A down to the one D I have D F G A. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I just saw online too. Hey, so it's... Stop hitting that note. Whoopsies. This is hard to hit, having to switch between those two. What if I do... Nope, I need to do that. All right, better hand placement here if we do. Ba, 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 ba. There it goes. Stupid right handed. There it goes. What if I do it this way? That one feels better. That feels way smoother. I think we figured out the whole song, guys. So instead of going back to this, it's this for the end, right? 
Guys, I think we have our first song. I think that's it. Oh my god, I'm actually super, like, excited right now. It doesn't feel like it, but, like, my heart just started pumping. That's awesome. Ah, got too fast. Why can't I do that anymore? There it is. Oh, that's why I'm using the wrong hand again. There it is. Oops. Okay, so it's bum 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 bum. There it is. And now you understand. Ugh. I think that's a that's this might be a little bit of a stretch that I understand. <laughs> Whoops. Why did that sound different? There's a slightly different tone if I hit. Yep, there's a slightly different tone. You hear it? It's on the same note. It might be where it's starting to, it's a little close to another note. It sounds really pretty slowed down. Dang it. When I slow it down, though, I miss that note because I think my brain is keeping in tempo of whatever beats per minute it is. So if I do. See, there's a timing there and my thumbs can do it when I'm fast. But when I slow it down, my fingers are like, you should be getting away from this beat now. I think that's my problem on that one. Understand the music rush? Yeah, yeah. That, w that was interesting. Oh, I forgot the second part. Oops, did it again. Oops. I need to stop relying on my right hand. Would it be smarter to go? Nope, because then I'd have to drop here and that's not smart. Hey, stop slurping. It's gross. Oops, hey, I'm watching you.
Oops. Now I'm messing it up. I gotta go back to the, the for first for some reason the first scale is what's killing me. That one. Maybe it's because I'm relying like that one feels like it's Yeah, that one has more left notes, I think. Man, this thing sounds beautiful. Like, I don't understand. Like, it's it's like hauntingly calming. You, you guys getting that? It just sounds really pretty. Oops, I'm doing the wrong note. Like... That sounds interesting, but when you really slow it down, it sounds good. Like, can I hit? Yeah, maybe I don't want to do that. Whoa. So there's those little drumstick things too. Those could make probably an interesting sound. And that actually might, cause like I always wanted to learn drums growing up and like I can do drum beats like re a lot better with my wrists, you know? So I'm wondering if I could play this better and maybe have a more consistent sound. All right, I like it slow. It's hard hitting this note when stupid arm wrist is here. I started getting off the scale. I started moving into the center of the thing. That's a weird switch. <sighs> All right, we'll get it, we'll get it.
Ha ha ha! First successful full play. Yep, I, I did the wrong cross there. <sighs> Going too quick again. By the way, I was probably at least four or five months before I could pick up a song by ear at all, and it was Epona's. Nice! Oh, that's another one I need to learn. Oh, what's hers? Dee -dee -dee. That's the wrong note. I, I should not try to learn another song. All the songs that I actually learned on my ocarina, which is not many, I, I, I taught myself by ear. Um, I'm usually really quick on that. It's just I'm not fast enough, so I get bored. Or I only learn a section of it. Like, I was teaching myself Concerning Hobbits, which you know how to play, which is awesome. I only know the first little bit of it. Um, and then after that, I was like, all right, well, this is too much for my brain to memorize efficiently because I'm in, I, when I'm, when I'm learning it, I'm learning it, but I'm speed reading, learning it, you know, it's like, okay, cool. But I'm not getting the muscle memory and the actual learning bit of it down. I'm just getting the cram it into my brain so I can regurgitate it. I'm not committing it to memory. So what I need to do is get out of that cram session memory mindset and turning it into like an actual knowledge mindset and i and that's difficult for me to do And see, and you can tell when I get into the um, the cram session mindset is because when I'm doing this, and I need to come back to this note at the end of that to start it back over to finish up to that, my brain immediately goes to the finish instead of doing the. It immediately just goes finishes it, and that's the cram session mindset that I'm trying to get away from. That's why it's not working. Yeah, I, you, I can't use my left hand here. had it. Come on. I was on a roll. Oh. 
chill. Is that right? That sounded, or that felt really wrong there for a second. If I can get that note down, I'll I'll train my br my finger in my brain that I need to hit this twice. So it's so then when I get that second note, it'll know that it's time to switch to that. That's a long way to travel. Yeah, I can't do that. That's hitting three notes in a row. hit that one too hard it's you can hear my my ankle or my my ankle my knuckle hit it and i don't like that whoa i started playing a different song mama hey mama stop you don't why do you why do you gotta slurp? It's so gross. shift right there is killing me. That's why. dog's gone. I'm going to slightly shift. Let's see if this helps.
that was going to be the best one. Also, my face feels like super blaringly white. Is it because this TV is on? No? Okay. Oops. We'll get this. Alright, if I I'm I'm hitting this note at the top. Oh, <gasps> that might be my problem. So when I'm hitting this note, I'm actually hitting the lower side of it. In the the note I have issues on this side, I'm hitting the top. But if I train myself to hit the bottom, it might work out better. That's a longer distance to travel though. It was Dude, you were super helpful. Thank you for dropping in, and I appreciate you just hanging out and, you know, experiencing some musics and giving me some tips and advice. I greatly, I uh, greatly, I greatly appreciate it. <laughs> Backseat musician, heck yeah, man. Uh, yeah, man. Just uh, I don't know. Uh, I want to do more, but I have the fear. I have the fear. You know what I mean? I'm sure you you know exactly what I'm talking about, but. Uh, yeah, maybe we'll learn some Epona song, because that's great, and Zelda's lullaby, you know? Th those might be, like, my little baby stepping stones. Or, like, showing me that I'm learning, or my progress. You'd be like, oh, look, I know these doofy little songs I can play. Um, and then eventually that'll encourage me to play bigger and better songs, but... Thank you, Zazelis. appreciate you dropping in, man. We'll catch you next time. Take care of yourself. had two in a row you know that fear <laughs> i appreciate it man i really do i really do hopefully i'll see uh be able to drop into one of your streams again soon i haven't seen you on also i need to check my notifications because occasionally they just stop notifying me for some streamers so i have to occasionally go into their channel make sure turn them off turn them back on so i'll catch you definitely Oh, why did I hit that? <laughs> that was a wrong note, wrong note, wrong note. I'm doing it again. Why am I hitting that note now? Gonna be the perfect one. All right, I can actually hit the notes without even looking at the space room now. So
That's a good sign, right? That makes that's a little encouraging. All right, before I sign off, I want to have a perfect one. That's what we're going for. Missed it. Completely missed it. Too fast. Hitting too hard or too soft. I need to fix that. I don't know why I'm skipping that note now. Also, I'm going too fast. It sounds prettier slower. My thumbs aren't hurting anymore, which is crazy. Maybe I've learned how to hit the drum.
Get slower so I should slow it down. fast again. Mamas, what are you doing? What do you got in your mouth? What are you being doofy for? I love you. I can't, I can't be up here because then I can't. It looks weird. Come on. I just want one really good sounded one. That's all I'm asking. fast.
Oops, I was just trying to do that again. Maybe I do need to switch up. That that feels like maybe too long of a cross and there's a slight delay. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. That's so much better. Because then I can go. Bah, 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 bah. Maybe not. Maybe not. Hold on. Yeah. So I have to go from. I have to do that in the middle. Oops. Yeah, that works a lot better. So now I have to retrain. break them up. It feels like I'm doing uh, figure eight with my hands. Is that all right cool we can learn that ahead of myself.
my muscle memory is cuz I can do this now. I can do that now, but my muscle memory for the actual song is interfering. So I need to break that original memory. There he goes. Ah, oh, I did the end. Whoops. that come on hand wrong note oh my hand gets in that zone and just tries to go for the finish Bad muscle memory there. All right, I can get this, I can get this. Camera's a little janky again. Hey, I think I finally did it. I think I finally did it. Maybe. Maybe. Shit. I just got rid of all that stuff on accident. Whoops. Almost had it.
wonder if I should plop down or swing. That might be better. Oh man, it's driving me nuts. I can't do it anymore. Yeah, okay. Come on, come on, fingers. Gross dog farting. Whoa, that was way wrong. Yeah, I keep trying to speed it up to the actual s speed of the song and I don't like it.
Why did I go up there? Maybe I need to take a break because my brain is all sorts of messed up now. Yeah, I think uh, my brain is getting tired or something because I'm making horrible mistakes now. See, I can't even hit the notes anymore. Oh, that could have been a good one. There's got to be a more efficient way to hold my hands, and I just don't know it.
Oh, I went the wrong way. Oh my gosh, that might be the best one we've done. Holy crap. No way. No way. Okay. Um, although I think that might be the end of the stream because I've been streaming for almost three hours and uh, I think my brain is getting tired because I'm making all sorts of bad mistakes that I wasn't making right here. And uh, I don't want to start forming bad habits. So let's bring this back over here. All right. Well, that was fun. Uh, we learned a song, so success. Um, I guess we'll have to see if I actually learned it, learned it. Uh, I might have to try to keep this up so I can try to commit all that to memory as, as well as the, the scales. I need to try to commit those to memory as well. I don't know, maybe I'll do some practicing and stuff off stream. That, that, that might be uh, wise and I apologize for stuttering. I'm actually kind of anxious, nervous, something. I, I've got jittery nerves. I don't know what that's about. But uh, thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, remember to like, subscribe, comment. It helps me out a lot. Let's me know what you're liking, what you're not liking. Um, I don't know if this is going to go up on YouTube or not. Mm, why not? Maybe I'll just do the clip. Maybe I'll do the whole thing. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe some people are interested in watching the learning process. I don't know. Uh, so that'll be interesting. I'll have to create some overlay or not overlays, uh, thumbnails and stuff. I don't know. Well, uh, we'll give that a shot. Anyways, if you guys liked it, if you want to see more of this, you know, be sure to Send me messages in Discord or personal messages on Twitter. I don't know. I don't know. Send me something. Dog over there is farting. Anyways, thank you guys for tuning in to me. Remember to spay new to your pets. Adopt, don't shop. Donate to a rescue if you can afford it. Or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out that very much need. I really hope this is sounding okay coming through because I didn't do any of those filters, but I guess we'll find out after this. Anyways, I'm Vasive. Thank you for tuning in to me. I'll catch you next time. See ya.